justice. So before you watch this video, I have to say a couple of things. First of all, this first section you're about to watch is super embarrassing because I was all excited in this clip and talking about how to that night, which was last night, how we were going to have this big banquet on the streets. I thought it was like this revolutionary idea that we were going to invite people to the streets and set up tables and we were just going to basically invite people to dinner in the highways and the byways and then serve them dinner. And uh, so you'll see that in this next clip and just laugh about it because I was way off. It had nothing to do with that. It was just it was just a Christmas party. The second thing that you need to know is that because we were at this Christmas party, there's lots of copyrighted music in the background and I can't upload the, that kind of stuff onto these videos. So I am going to overlay it with amazing music that you can enjoy that isn't copyrighted. Good morning, everyone. There's an old saying, which I am paraphrasing because I don't have internet here in Guatemala right now to actually check up word for word what it says, but it says something like this. To the angels in heaven, it makes no difference whether they are sweeping the dirtiest alleyway in the worst city on earth or if they are serving the king in the most beautiful of palaces. All that matters is that they are doing the will of God. So today, we have these past few days we've been preaching and doing all of these awesome things but today we are going to be with Pastor Oseas cleaning the church we are literally going to be sweeping the streets of the town that we're staying in and we're going to be preparing the the insides of the church as well because tonight we are having some kind of banquet for the town it's a really cool idea I've never heard of anybody doing it before and uh, but Oseas this is something that they do I don't know how many times they've done it but they're inviting people from around town to come and have like a dinner, like a banquet tonight in the streets right in front of the church. We're going to be setting up tables and uh, chairs and all this kind of stuff. And we bought toys and all kinds of different things. And so it's going to be really exciting. I'll tell you more about it as we go because I'm he, he told us that this is what we're doing today. So we're going to go and we'll find out more as we go along. But I am really excited about it because I haven't been a part of anything like this before where we're just going to be out on, I mean, it's not like a street service. We're going to be having dinner on the street and we're going to be just inviting people. Like the Bible talks about inviting people on the high, you know, God said, go out to the highways and the byways and invite people to come in. Well, that's, that's literally what we're doing. We're going out and inviting people to, uh, to come onto the street and to just be blessed. And then I'm going to be sharing tonight. And it's going to be interesting. There's, it's a mixed crowd. We have some people from the church and we have some people who are uh, non-believers. So uh, I'm just going to testify. I'm going to tell testimonies of the awesome power of God and the reason that I believe in God, which is because of just the fact that he's so real and the miracles and the, the awesome things that I've seen. So stay tuned. I will show you more as we go throughout this day. So before we start cleaning up, we're going to head out and invite people on the streets for the event tonight. So there's something like 50,000 people in this town and it's a port so you know ports usually uh, not only do they have a lot of finances a lot of times but also it's a melting pot there's tons of different cultures and you know products and our businesses that get mixed in here so it's really interesting to see that mix at work you know we're right where we're like half a mile from the beach so we're here right now you know, inviting people and just the the different you know, the, all, it's, it's such a family kind of atmosphere. It's just so interesting that the, the kind of beach, you know, there's such a, such a relaxed sort of, you know, yeah, sure, we'll go. So it's it's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, we just walked down just sort of saying, just grabbing people to just say, hey, on this street tonight, we're gonna be hanging out and having food and all kinds of fun stuff. So check this out, okay, look at this house. Concrete, 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 concrete. Incredible door of majesty. Concrete, concrete, smaller door of majesty. More concrete. Also, door of majesty and a dog on the roof. This is the best house I've ever seen in my life. 
So our ministry, Found Ministries, is really blessed to have a lot of people who partner with us, different churches and individuals, and even a couple businesses that part partner with us. We're really blessed to have them, not just praying for us, not just for their friendship, but also for the donations that they give. And one of those donations, or one of the things we've been able to do with those donations, is to provide the toys for this event tonight. For kids, for all the people that we invited here, we, their kids that are coming, we're giving like fruit juice, and we're gonna sing some songs. I'm gonna talk about the meaning of Christmas, and then we're gonna be giving out toys and, as Christmas presents for the kids here. So it's really a blessing. I wanna thank the people who partnered with us. You guys are awesome, you guys make this happen. God is so good to have brought us together, and I'm excited, and I'm about to show you more. You know, everybody talks about their favorite Bible verse, the one that touches them the most, the one that has provided the calling for their lives. For me, my favorite Bible verse, or one of them, is in Isaiah 14, whenever God says, I will sweep them with the broom of justice. Filth has been swept from these dirty streets. Time to set up chairs. They're set up. Time to give presents to children. Preaching the gospel. Back to regular stuff. galletas y cosas así unos a otros y es hermoso es algo bueno hacer pero Dios tenía el regalo más grande de todos y todo creación esperando, esperando años pasaron, el rey David vino entonces ok Queremos pedirle a las niñas que lo que... Eh, le... About to light some balloons to finish the event. These are like helium balloon kind of things. They have a piece of soap on them. We're going to light them and they're supposed to float into the amazingness of the night.
stay tuned with this channel because I'm gonna be putting up another video based on this night where we had a really awesome miracle happen. It's just too long to fit all into one video. So I'm gonna be breaking it up and uh, we'll show, I'll show it in another video later. And so just stay tuned for it. If you like this, please like, subscribe, leave any comments, anything you liked, anything you didn't like, and uh, any comments, anything you'd like to see, any questions, and stay tuned because there's a lot more adventure coming. Thank <laughs> you.